fellow Disney nerds, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. Hi, I'm Roxana. In today's video, I have some magic mail for you guys, a haul. Um, so I have for you guys is um, a flower and garden haul. I know you guys are thinking, Roxana, Disney World is closed. How are, and you clearly didn't go to Disney. How on earth do you have a haul from Flower Garden? The answer to that is simple. I, um, Danita from Absolutely uh, Fabulous did a pickup for me while she was at Disney right before they closed. And she was lucky enough to go to um, Flower and Garden before um, Disney announced their closing. Um, and I had her pick her up. I had her pick up a few items for me from Flower Garden. Um, so, yeah. And it came in this box. I've got it pre-opened. I did not look inside, although I know what's in it. Um, but for you guys, it's going to be a mystery. All right. So, let's dive right in. Okay. So, item number one. Oh, okay. Oh, they must be in here. Okay. Anyways, so the first thing that I had her um, pick up for me is the Orange Bird Backpack. It's, I guess they're they're calling it a lounge slide, but I don't think it is a lounge slide. Um, it's got it's got this straw material, which um. It's different and it's nice. Um, it's nice that they're using like a natural made um, material for the bag. And I love orange board. He feels like a, um, what's it called? Like a vinyl, like on here, or like he was, like if you, for those of you who have a cricket, you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, that's what he feels like to me. Um, and then you've got like oranges right here and then different flowers right there and leaves surrounding orange bird. And then it says Epcot International Flower Garden Festival 2020 down here. Um, this will make a perfect summer bag. And then, oh, okay. This is what the inside looks like. It's straw and it has like a, um, right here, this orange right here. Let's see if you, there we go. That feels like a vinyl, like a, um, waterproof material. Um, and this, and then, and then right here, here, this trim right here and then this trim right here, it feels like a faux leather. Um, and then these are the straps. Oh, good. These are adjustable straps, which is nice. Um, so it's got that, like, seatbelt e material, that, like, um, nylon. There we go. Nylon material. Um, and then it, this, like, faux leather handle. And then... Wait until you see what's inside the bag. I'm super excited. The orange board headbands. Okay. Let me put this down. So she also got me the orange bird headbands. Um, this is my second orange bird um ears that I've gotten in. The first pair of orange board ears came from um, an Etsy ear shop um, called um, Enchanted Character Ears. And um, you know what? Let me go grab them and show you what, what they look like. They're a little different in comparison to these. All right. So here are the ones from the Etsy shop. Um, as you can tell, these have um, orange bird for each ear, like it's just his face, so it's his eyes and his beak. Um, that's hair. 
and then the bow is it has this um like stem like leaves um portion and then the headband is orange it, it is the matching orange and these are a little bit more puffier than the park ears not by much um and then it, it's got a black um trim lining and then these are the park ears where it's just orange bird on this side his little um green leaf stem here and then the bow on this one it's um the material for the both the ears the bow and the um headband are like a satiny fabric and the, the bow on this one is puffier where this one is more of a flat bow and it's sequined and it's got flowers on the bow here let me okay so here's a close-up of the ears so you've got flowers right here don't mind a tag that's gonna come off soon and then he's got hello sunshine right here and then walt disney world a flower oh let's see right there and a flower down here and then you've got flowers embroidered on hold on let me try to get this there you go on this side of the headband you've got flowers um embroidered sorry i know weird lighting there we go you've got flowers embroidered right on that side and then this tag's gonna come off it, it this bothers me um and then on this side you've got flower um epcot international flower and garden festival 2020 and bordered on this side um i don't know i don't know if it's coming out let me try there we go so on that side and you've got a flower that's embroidered there um and then on the back right here you've got flowers and leaves back here and then more flowers and leaves back here so these are the ears i absolutely love these now to try them on take off these ears okay put on these ears oh my word these are super cute i love how they look on they feel very comfortable um i like that they're a bit the the headband is a bit like it feels like it's padded on the inside like it, the headband feels a little bit on the puffy side um which is nice a little extra padding on the headband definitely helps with um them not hurt, hurting although i personally am not bothered with disney headbands i personally find them comfortable i might be one of the odd few that finds them comfortable that's just me um but these are these definitely are the, the headband itself definitely is comfortable it does not feel tight um i could probably wear this as long as the same amount of time as I wear my um the ears that I get from swaps or the ears that I get from Etsy or my own ears that I make myself um these are really really adorable really sad that you can't quite experience and go to the flower and garden festival currently um hopefully Disney might I'm really hoping Disney will extend it a little bit um past June because yeah <laughs> I really would like to go and 
This bag is really cute. I, um, when Danita was down there, I was debating on whether or not to get the match, the, the orange, uh, matching orange bird, um, spirit jersey, um, and I don't know. I'm really hoping since Disney is closed that they will restock online, but I don't think that will happen. Um, it'd be, it'd be awesome if you could still purchase the Flower Garden merch online on Shop Disney. Um, but I don't know as to how Disney's going to handle all that. But yeah, I don't think I showed you guys the inside. So the inside is just a plain orange, like nylon E um, lining. Which is fine, um, and it does feel deep inside, and then, let me close this up, <laughs> okay, no, so I thought it had two side pockets, and it looks like they're just there for decoration, which is fine, um, I barely use the side pockets unless I'm putting something small in the side pockets, so, so um, the front pocket, uh, hold on one second. So this is my phone. It's the iPhone 11 Max Pro. Let me see and test out if it'll fit. Okay, so, uh, don't mind the screen. Uh, email just came in. Considering the size of my phone, that's not too bad. Like, there's still wiggle room for adding a few more things um, into the front pocket. So, if you are someone like me and you have the iPhone 11 or the iPhone 11 Pro or the 11 Pro Max, it'll fit into the front pocket of this backpack. Um... So, and for those of you who want to see, I know it does not look like it on screen, but trust me, um, you will definitely be able to fit it in. You just got to be very careful. So, you know, see, I was able to just, if you just put it in at an angle and s slide it in carefully, it'll fit. Um, it'll for sure fit. So, yeah, I can't wait to use this this summer. This would be a perfect summer um, bag to carry around. It's really cute. I, it's, um, the materials are lightweight, which is nice. Um, so, yeah, I definitely can't wait to use this this summer. And thank you, Danita, for picking it up for me. Um, so, yeah, that is... All the magic mail that I have for you guys today. Um, and yeah, I'll see you lovely Disney in my next video. Bye guys.